Hello, it's Adrian. How are you doing? And I'm back today. Um, officially ill, which sucks. But I've been playing with the makeup, and so I thought I'd go ahead and film a look. Um, I actually went ahead and uh, used some um, colors out of my C palette, and I haven't been playing with my C palette for a while. So I thought I'd go ahead and do this look. Uh, I did go ahead and start as far as the foundation with the Sneaky Balm in the N13. So that's what I have on there. Um, I do also have on the Pretty Fresh Concealer. I am ill and, yeah, can't get around not using concealer right now. But I do think the Sneaky Balm on days when I'm not ill <laughs> would... Uh, actually work really well and I don't think I'll need a concealer uh, with the sneaky balm but um, right now being ill I definitely do and so what I did was I went ahead and used these three colors right here these are actually this one this one and this one or let's see this one this one and this one uh, so these three right here are uh, Sydney Grace singles I got a long time ago so again, I went ahead and used these to go ahead and start the look. And then what I went ahead and did with the rest of it was uh, I used the Emirate um, eyeliners. And I sort of smudged them. I was sort of thinking graphic liner. Um, but with the way that these were working with the look, I did go ahead and smudge them. So I had the yellow on then the orange on, and then the pink on, uh, orange and yellow again. So it does sort of, you know, it reflects each other on the bottom eyeliner. So I thought, or it reflects the top eyeliner on the bottom eyeliner. That's what I'm trying to say. So I thought it turned out really fun. And I wanted to go ahead and um, go ahead and share it with everyone. And then as far as the rest of the face, I did go ahead and use a Lumi uh, bronzer. This one's a medium. And uh, let me see here. There we go. So uh, that's what this one looks like. And that's what I used as my bronzer. I did go ahead and mix my blushes today. Um, I did pick up the Gel Crush by Flower Beauty. So this is uh, part of what I have on this blush today. If I can get it to kind of, so you can see the color here. And then I went ahead and mixed it with this one from Wet n Wild. And this one, uh, Peachy Bumps, I think is, Peach Bumps is what it says there. Uh, so these are the two blushes that I mixed, and uh, they are both uh, cream blushes, so they did mix really well together. And um, let's see, what else did I go ahead and use on this particular look? Um, I did the Essence Volume Stylus 18 Hour Wear, and the NYX Thick It Stick It in Light Ash Brown. And I also went ahead and used the Catrice Sungasm Powder as far as a finishing powder on this. And then the Juvia's The Heroin Glow 2 for my highlighter. So that's what I have on there. Yeah. And I did go ahead and use um, the L'Oreal Infallible Paints Metallic. And this one is in 332. So that's what I have on the lips, as far as the eyes. And I mean, this could be a very pretty spring look. <clears throat> a little bit fiery, a little bit in your face and kind of like, oh. Um, but I think it's a lot of fun. So um, that's just about all that I have for today. Oh, except for, I was going to go ahead and add in that I'm pretty sure if you wanted to do this look or something close to it, you could actually use the Winx by ColourPop to do that. Um, you've got the yellow here. You've got the orange. 
and um, then you also have the orange and the matte here. Uh, the pink, you have both a pink, um, so you would be able to definitely go ahead and recreate this look using that palette. And again, the eyeliners, these are the Emirate ones. I got them on the Timu website, T-E-M-U. Um, so yeah, I thought it turned out really fun. And so I thought I'd go ahead and share it. And um, I guess that's all I have for the video. And thank you and have a great day. Bye.